So uh, this is the, fo the final follow-up from the lesson that we, the mini lesson we did at the start of the week, and it's the end of the week now, so that's quite a nice time to do the final lesson. Uh, what I was playing there was the same, uh, the same phrase that we did at the start of the week, which was uh, the paradiddle with the uh, kick, which is right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left, or with the left hand as left, right, left, left, right, left, right, right. And all I was doing, again, was placing the kick drum on the second note of the paradiddle. So there's eight notes within a paradiddle. Uh, the kick drum was replacing the, the first left hand. So the right left became the right kick, right, right, left, right, left, left. Um, all of that was in the same time signature. And I'll just explain kind of how I got to that point. So what that's based on is instead of playing a paradiddle now as a semiquaver, so for example, uh, if you're playing a groove like this, instead of doing that, I was playing uh, the paradiddle as triplet semiquavers. So instead you get... If I play that really slowly, if I get it right, slowly. So what that means is to fit in with a bar, if you're playing triplet semiquavers, you're getting, uh, instead of your 16 notes that you get with semiquavers, you're, you're getting your uh, 24 notes this time. So it's, it's three times around the pattern instead of, instead of two, three parallels instead of two. Um, so if I just play that, I've kind of covered kind of that. So just playing on the hi-hat, so you've got your right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left, but played in a, in a triplet way. Now, what I was doing, which was kind of giving us a metric modulation effect, which is where we place uh, the accent of the groove, if you like, to so the backbeat you know, of the groove, giving the impression we're in another time signature. Now, because, I, because a paradiddle is a, a phrase built over four and eight notes, that kind of multiple, if I turn it into a triplet, we're getting our accents. It's quite difficult to follow, but there is a notation sheet to go with this where you can kind of pick it up. Uh, we're getting the accents on still on the one and the fourth note. So, for example, if I play it simply, if I, if I do it in that way, but because it's on every four notes within a triplet, it gives the effect of, of speeding up the groove. So, if I just play it, uh, rather than the original lick, which I'll come to in a second, I'll just play it as I did, but in, in context. So you get... So instead of... Um, now we get... clapping along with it when you watch the video to keep the pulse the same. The pulse is still there doing that. It's exactly the same. But to the listener, it sounds like you're speeding up or, or changing the time. Now, um, when you're playing it, that kind of thing, it's the best way I find to work it out is to hear where the accents are in relation to the original pulse. So instead of obviously your accents originally being like... get that, that sort of feel. I'm not sure if that was completely right, but you get that kind of feel of the different, of the different rhythms here. That was stupid because I did something I'd never done before. Anyway, uh, let's, uh, we're just going to go on to the final bit of the sheet, which is taking, doing what I was doing at the start now, where we take the original groove and we play it, which is the start of the week. Now, the extra thing I did, just to finish up, because this is going on for ages, so I'm sorry, is that I just played it as a fill instead. in other toms, so we get this. So, great seven. Yeah, so we get that kind of triplet feel there. So I'll just play some of it again, and I'll just gradually speed it up like we did last time. I think, is that what I'd like to do? Yes, that is what I'd like to do. And um, uh, so you can kind of hear it in context. So I'll give the groove a little bit of a triplet sort of feel as well, just to kind of help with that. So.
bit more. Anyway, so I do my thing. Yay! <laughs>